So this is a holiday ghost story. You may know the Victorian tradition of holiday ghost story. <laughs> My lords and ladies, I thank you for the honor of calling me before you on this night of holiday celebration to share with you my tale. It is my sacred honor to guard you who repose here in this feasting hall with your meat and drink in your warmth and sumptuosity. Like Marcellus and Bernardo on watch at the castle of Elsinore, my mate and I stalk the battlements by night in search of rest, sick at heart, each kept awake by, by our own haunts. We traffic the boards, the stairs, the offices, wielding light and halberd against such foes as all enemies who threaten our castle, our state. Sometimes, ghostly on our cold watch, we pass one another in the shadowy night. To avoid startling the alarm, we softly call to each other through the fog, the mists of our enforced patrol. In our bitter occupation, we trade tales of the frightening apparitions we have seen. A strange hallucination, a specter that watches with us on the sleepless battlements. A strange hallucination, but it does not slumber. Though no human form does this dread sight take, but that of one or another or both, of two small cats who silently appear, watch us with their lamp-like eyes, stirring us with fear and wonder, and disappear when they have failed to give whatever answer was sought. What these specters portend we have debated on many a long, cold night on the wall. Other nights, we could remember nothing. These silent mysteries of the night are eventually, mercifully, interrupted by the toll of the bell, signaling that my watch has ended, and I may return to bed, where I may attempt to sleep and dream of the cold, silent, misty watch on the walls. And God willing, dream not of the unearthly forms that stalk that there. But I must go now, my beloved lords and ladies, for the clock chimes and calls me to the wall again. I leave you to con contemplate your blessed holiday, your bounteous feast, and the mysteries that none of us shall ever know or understand. Thank you.